guys, it's me Des, and today is actually a pretty cool video. I'm going to do the whole video soft-spoken today, well tonight, yeah, it's 9 o'clock, so tonight. I went to an Asian market that I randomly like stumbled upon, turns out it's not even five minutes away from my house, so it's like, I'm gonna start going there a lot. I bought a bunch of cool little snacks to eat for you guys. So I have some taro mochi. I actually ate one already. These ones were a bit cheap. Um, they're more on the cheaper side. I think they were like two dollars and something. And they also had some that cost like six dollars and that was the real like ice cream one and I'm actually going to get that one next time. But um, this one's actually pretty good. I thought this was powdered sugar on top but it's actually like a little starch powder. Next, I have dumplings. I'm really excited to eat these. I'm going to have to eat them soon so they don't get cold. But they probably look burnt because of the lighting, but they're actually really crispy. And this is pork and cabbage dumplings. And then I bought super crispy um, seaweed strips. They look like this. They're not really strips, but they're really crispy. And then in the same plaza, there's this store called Nutrition Smart, and they have like really healthy options for like everything. And I found these sea salt and vinegar. Um, I actually bought these after I went to the Asian market. So um, if I knew this was going to be there, I wouldn't have gotten the crisps. They're both really good either way, so. I'm just going to get into it. I'm going to start with the dumplings. I'm just going to pour the soy sauce packet on the plate. So it's kind of like they're dipped in there. I've been craving dumplings for like two or three months now. I just never knew where to get them, but now. I also have some water. Start with this one. Mm. These are really good. I'm going to start getting these. <clears throat> it's actually pretty good with soy sauce. And I'm going to show you how crunchy it is. It was better when it was like freshly hot, but. Mm. They're so crispy. Next time I'm going to put green onions on top because I love scallions. My brother actually ended up liking these also, so I'm going to start buying these more.
-hmm. I had like a smudge on my glasses. So I just took them off. So I'm going to get one more. Then I think I'll just give the rest to my brother because he actually really likes them. So I'll get this one. It looks really crispy. I'm going to give these to my brother and I will be right back. All right, so next I'm going to eat the mochi. So on the box, it had um, like the filling color was like purple, like the taro color is. But um, this one's actually like a pasty color, obviously, because it's paste, you'll see. The quality of this is so different than the one I'm used to because I usually go to the sushi restaurant that's actually like not even a minute away from the Asian market. Like everything's pretty close. So um, I think they actually make the mochi fresh every day there. It's so good. And that one has ice cream in it. So hopefully the ice cream one I try at the market tastes similar to that one because this one's not as stretchy like the dough. This is the filling. The powder is really squeaky when I bite it. So I've been trying to like wipe the powder off, but it's still so squeaky. Like this kind of tastes like tapioca pearls and then that's the taro. So it kind of tastes like bubble tea. They actually had um, small tapioca pearls there and big ones and they had rainbow ones. Um, but it was one that you had to boil yourself. And I almost bought it and then like boiled it with some honey. But I'll probably do that another time. It's really sweet. <clears throat> so I'll probably get one more. And then... Drink all this powder off. There's so much of it. It's still on my shirt. So this will probably be my last one tonight. And the next time you see me eating, the rest will probably be tomorrow or something. And tea's really good for costing two dollars. 
and it wasn't even in the cold section so it's like just on the shelf so it's not bad at all for a two dollar box <laughs> I honestly don't think I can even finish the other half. Next is the sea salt and vinegar seaweed. I actually like these a lot. <clears throat> mm. I have powder from the mochi all over my bed. So good. Oh my gosh. So when I went to the Asian market, I was really the only black person in there. And there were like four other shoppers, but they were all Asian, obviously. And like two of them looked at me so weird. I'm just like, yes, I'm a black girl shopping at Asian market. I love Asian food. Trying to eat the whole thing. It's so good. All right, now I'm going to eat these crispy ones. If you thought those ones were crunchy, just listen. These are grilled seaweed. The brand is Tao Kai Noi. Those dumplings are actually really filling. Mm. These ones are kind of sweet. They don't have as much as like like they do have an ocean taste to it, but it's not as strong as these organic seaweed snacks. Mm. 
looks like I'm so full, but they're so good. So I saw these spinach noodles there. I think I want to buy those and put like pesto, tomatoes, and something else I'll end up finding. But I think I'm going to try the spinach pasta. I thought it looked really good. These are $2.49 and they give me a really good amount of this stuff. Like that mochi is really fulfilling because usually when I get um like candy from the dollar store and stuff, I finish those like in the same night. But I know for sure <clears throat> I cannot finish these until <laughs> like Probably won't even finish these tomorrow. I think to balance this out. I'm going to leave it off on a salty note. I just ate so much sweet stuff, so... That was like actually really sweet. So I'm going to eat another salt one or two or three. Let's try two together. My belly <clears throat> cannot take any more food. All right, I will see you guys in like one second, but for me tomorrow. So it's actually the next day and this is all I have left. And it was actually really hard for me not to eat all of these last night too. I just eat the rest of my dumplings, but um, <clears throat> I was with my brother, so I couldn't make a video of it. Tonight, me and my brother are going to be watching that interactive Black Mirror movie. We just finished watching a Bird Box movie last night. I just feel like they could have explained more. But it wasn't that bad.
I just washed my hair, so it's still damp right now. This curl will not stand in place. It's either in too much or it's like popping out. Whatever. <laughs> okay. I have like little pieces of seaweed falling on my bed. In Japanese. Oh, that was all of it. Some crumbs. They have like half of a piece of mochi left. So I guess I'll go ahead and eat that to you. Here it is. Literally half. Um, me and my brother were watching Coraline last night. I ended up eating everything. guys enjoyed this video be sure to give this video a big thumbs up please like this video comment any requests or anything you'd like and subscribe and i will see you guys next time